Good morning. Okay, so um, I'm frantically cleaning today, but I swear today I am going to start that ice cream, that figgy ice cream. And it starts off with a bourbon sauce, a bourbon caramel sauce. So um, I'm going to walk the dog, and then, you know, when I get back, I'd like to start um, making some uh, bourbon caramel to go into the figgy ice cream. <laughs> I want to show y'all the size of bag of charcoal that I go through and it lasts, I don't know, it'll last me maybe like a week and a half, but <laughs> I don't know if y'all can see this, this thing is huge! <laughs> you can see. It's a beast! So, um, I'm gonna start you know, making a caramel sauce. I've used a stick of butter. I threw that on medium low in a little uh, pan. And I'm gonna put in um, some brown sugar. A cup. Brown sugar. And um, I'm gonna let that melt and cook a little bit. And then I'm gonna put um, a can of sweetened condensed milk. And um, I, <laughs> I thought I had corn syrup, but I don't. So I'm gonna just add it honey and um, a little lemon juice because um, that's a substitute you can do if you don't have corn syrup. Is add a little lemon juice or cream of tartar. So it's a trick. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can pull off some bourbon caramel sauce and I'll, sauce and I'll add the bourbon um, later too when I, when I add all this stuff. Yum, yum. Okay, so I've um, melted my, I'm doing the okay. That's Koopy. Mm -hmm. He makes funny sounds. Okay, so, so is Gizzy. She's, it's, it's thundering really loud out and the dog is coming up and staring at me, shaking, she's shivering. Okay, so um, I melted my brown sugar and my um, butter, and I stirred that for a few minutes. And I'm gonna add a can of sweetened condensed milk. And um, some honey and uh, lemon juice. Okay. How's it going? What you got? Is that a mango? An orange. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Here. I'll do it in a minute, okay? Hold on. Yummy. Okay, I'm going to put that back on the stove and I'm going to keep stirring it for a little bit. And we'll be back. So, um, I let that go for a few more minutes up there. It looks beautiful. Um, I also added a little bit of uh, cream of tartar that I mixed with a little water because they say, you know, that's another way to keep it from crystallizing. We'll see. You know, you just never know. I'm not, I'm not a, I'll be honest, I'm not a big sweets eater, so I don't make a lot of this stuff. But um, I just Googled making a <laughs> caramel sauce. Like it's something that looked really easy. I didn't want to sit there and do too much. And um, I'd already had a can of sweetened condensed milk that I'd opened yesterday and I'd used just like a tiny bit of it out. So 
Um, I wanted to use the rest of it. Anyway, this is what I saw. I have no idea. <laughs> I know I've labored over caramel sauce a few times and, you know, it, sometimes it crystallizes and then it's just like, ah. Uh, but, you know, sometimes it comes out and it's just so syrupy and it stays that way and it's wonderful. Um, the one that I was pulling up, they did not add bourbon, so I'm not really sure when I'm supposed to put the bourbon in, but I'm going to go ahead and do that now. <laughs> Alrighty, and um, I'm also going to add a little salt because that sounds good, salted bar mel uh, bourbon caramel sauce. This is a little pink Himalayan. I think salt makes everything better. <laughs> My neighbor says I am. Your recipes are so good, but you're a little heavy on that salt. <laughs> I like it. I think salt gives things flavor, and um, I cook it when I'm, like, when I'm steaming and, or boiling my vegetables and everything. Adds salt to the water and makes everything taste better. Brings out flavors. And sweet things, too. <laughs> a little bit of salt makes things, you know, gives it that richness. So... This looks really nice. Mm. <laughs> that is so good. Yeah. So, but, <laughs> the, you know, the, you don't really know with this stuff until you refrigerate it and see what happens. Mm. Oh man, that's good. That was easy. <laughs> so this is going to be, um, what I'd like it to do is uh, maybe firm up a little. And then um, I'm going to make some vanilla ice cream with uh, bourbon figs. And um, I'm going to run this through the ice cream. And I'd like um, a simple vanilla with, like I said, with, with, I was thinking, you know how yummy rum raisin ice cream is. Um, kind of getting that same effect, but with bourbon and figs, bur uh, bourbon preserved figs that I've, I've made on a previous video, if you're curious, um, how to do those. And then you can, it's, they're fun. <laughs> They'll be great in cocktails. I'll probably have to make some more after, you know, I use them in my ice cream. So that's it. Enjoy. Look, this would be good just the way it is, drizzled on top of anything. <laughs> so yummy. Bye.